Alright, next move is duck unders. Alright, duck unders works great when the guy's pushing into you. Like all my moves, I want the guy pushing into me. Alright, feel his pressure and react to it. So the first one I like to get, I like to work a lot of underhooks. Alright, feel strong. It's a strong position for me. So when I get an underhook, I want an underhook here. I want to have head position. Alright, head position's right in his neck. Alright, pushing his arm, pushing his head out. This guy's gonna tie me up, alright? I want on my shoulder. Alright, I want to push in. I want outside control on this. Alright, so when I push in, he pushes back. All I'm gonna do is lift his elbow, take a step outside with my with my back foot. Alright? Take a step outside. Alright, and you're ducking under. Here. Push in. He pushes back. Lift. Right to a duck under. My underhook hand is sliding down the body. Alright? So when I duck under, alright, this arm is sliding down. Down to his hip, or if you can, his legs. Sometimes you'll be able to slide all the way down to his knees and buckle his, buckle his knees in. So here, alright? Slide, buckle those knees. If you can get to the hip, that works awesome. So you have an underhook, head position, and he has, it, he has inside control. I push in, when I feel him push back, all I do is lift this elbow, take a step, and then it's like a swing single. Clearing those legs out. Once you wipe them around, finish. Underhook. Push in, he pushes back. Drive into him. Alright? It's key to swing those legs around. If you leave those legs out in front of them, guys will grab them, they'll funk you. Alright? Start rolling around. Alright? You want to clear those legs out. Alright? Push in, push in. Drive in. Nice and quick. One more time. Push in, lift this elbow, step outside, put the back leg, 